It will not stop till I've expunged this new world of every outcast. Godless creatures! My vengeance will be swift and true. <laughs> Hey guys, Halloween Man 2002 here back on our video on Crackstone from the TV show Wednesday. And I have to say this is he's pretty cool. I did I didn't know who he was when I first saw the photos because I've only saw the first two episodes of Wednesday and I haven't finished the show yet. Um out of all the characters they could have created, they went with Crackstone. Which, he's pretty cool, 7 foot. I really, really hate that price tag that they gave him. I don't think he's worth $407 for something that just turns side to side and blows fog. I don't know why he's higher than Wednesday and Cousin It. They're like 200 and he's like $400. Um, let me know your opinion about Crackstone down below. Um, let's move on to the next prop, which is Wednesday Adams. All right, now we're on to Wednesday Addles. I love this prop. She's pretty cool. She's very iconic. Sorry that I had the audio turned off. It was due to copyright issues. I love how Tacky tried to copy her dance move from the scene that she dances in. But she's one of my favorites. Will I pick her up? I don't like collecting licensed characters because they just don't fit in my haunted house. Um, if I do buy her, she'll probably go with the other licensed props that I do own that are sitting in my room. Um, I wish they used the Bloody Mary song from Lady Gaga. And I know, I know with the whole copyright and I know the song wasn't a part of the show. That was a trend on TikTok. But that was pretty cool. But let me know your opinion down below. And let's move on to Cousin It. So on to the last and third prop that I will be talking about in this video is Cousin It from the Addams Family movie. So he's the only character that's not in the Wednesday show, which he's in the main movies. So he's pretty cool. He's very, very accurate to the movies. Um, when we first heard of this prop, he was going to be a roaming prop, but... He just leans side to side, and he plays the Adams Family music. There's really not, not much to say about this one. Let me know your opinions down below about him. He's pretty cool. Will I pick him up? Probably not. I, I wasn't a big fan of Cousin It back then. But I might have him just to have him a part of the whole Adams Family collection. But anyways... Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and I'll see y'all in the next video.